Don't worry, this camera is definitely a cinch. Well, it's good. Are you ready? Um, I guess I'm ready as I'll uh, ever be. Okay, um, okay. listen, I'm, I'm just going to uh, push the on button and, and start the camera. And you just take your time and, and you just start whenever you're ready. Well, this is to you, my darling child. As I'm speaking to you, spring has just come to Port Charles. It's a very happy spring for your daddy and me. Be because we've just learned that you're on your way. You can't imagine what that means to us. You are going to be the most unique and special little person. I just know it because you were created out of such joy. And your daddy and I, we love each other so much. And with that kind of love, it's quite a jump start in a child's life. At least I think so. But you were also conceived through the friendship and love in friendship. You know, right now you're being carried into life by a very incredible woman. Her name's Lucy. And I hope that as you grow up, you'll be very close with her. Because she's so special. And she's very wise. And there's so much she can teach you. About giving. Without expecting anything in return. You know, there's so much that I want to tell you. But right now, all I can think about is, is what I've learned in the last few months. And that is that it's such a joy to be alive. Your dad knows that. Oh, he knows that. He really does. In fact, you have to get him to make you his special flower pancakes for breakfast. <laughs> They're pretty great. I did the best, and he's the best. He knows how to live life. Every minute of it. So please listen to him. Even you, when you may not like what he's saying. Just listen. And listen to the truth beneath the words. And let yourself feel his love. Because it is so strong. It'll get you through anything. You know, I really wish that I could leave you a world that was perfect, that you'd never know the touch of pain or, or hurt. But unfortunately, I can't do that. But what I do know is that you'll never truly be alone, and that my spirit will always be with you, living inside your heart and inside your father's heart, just like you will be with me. And that is something I know will never change. So please remember that with all my heart, I love you. Just, I, I just think that is probably the most beautiful thing I've ever heard. It's funny, once I started talking, I realized that there was so much I wanted to say. <laughs> Lucy, thank you so much. That was really a wonderful idea. I am never going to forget you, you know. And I promise I will do everything you ask me to do. I will make sure Scott gets the poem, and I will make sure that your child gets those letters, I promise. I know you will. Daphne? Daphne, are you okay? Uh, um, I, I, I think I just need my pills. You see, they're on the counter, okay? Well, I just need my pills. Okay, just, it's, just, this was too much for you, no, right? No, no. I, I just need my pills. Okay, okay, okay. I'll, I'll get them. I'll get them. I just need my pills. Here. Here, do you, do, you, do you want me to call Tony? I mean, I mean, do you no, want me to call no. him and... and... I, I think that I'll just take a little bit. 
Okay. All right, fine, listen. Um, I I'll, I'll just stay right here, all right? Uh, um, um, until Scott gets back. You don't have to do that. Yeah, I, I want to. You, you just... Uh, okay, go to sleep, okay? you rest and uh, close your eyes and I'll just be right here. No, Lucy. No, uh, Dominic, don't argue with me. I want to stay here. Close your eyes and just relax. I didn't want to tell you you're one of the most stubborn women. No, never. These are for you. It's so beautiful. I stole them from Felicia's garden. So it's already spring. Yep. Scott. Hmm? We have to go to the hospital now. What? setback. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let's go. We'll talk to Tony and you'll be home here and uh, before you know it, okay? Let's just get out of here and we'll do that. There's so much about this place that I want to remember. About the home we created together. It's a part of us. Wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Who is it? Hi. Listen, I'm, I'm sorry just to barge in like this, but I was on my way home and I happened by the toy store and I saw this in the window and I had to get it for you. I mean, I think it's perfect for the baby. It'll help the baby go to sleep. It winds up and everything. Don't you think it's the most perfect thing you've ever seen? Add luck to buy a baby something before it's even born, but I just think it's adorable, don't you? What, what is it? What's the matter? I have to go back to the hospital, Lucy. Oh, Dominique, are you, are you in pain? Or... Look, is there anything I could do? I mean, is there something? No. There, there has to be so something. Much. No, Dance Dominique, so anything. What can I do? All right, all right, Scott. Maybe, maybe you should maybe you should pick her up and carry her out. You know, no, I... no, no, no. If, if I'm going to be leaving this place, and it's going to be for the last time... I'm going to be doing it on my own two feet. Last time? Lucy, it's all right. Oh, no. no what I'd really me. like is for you to come to the hospital, okay? Come to the hospital. Come on. Okay, come on. I'll, I'll go get my car. I'll, I'll, I'll be right there. Yeah, I'm going to get your coat. 